Hello everyone, welcome back to the tutorial series. This time we're going to talk about how to install the TensorFlow in your machine. So it's, this one is fairly easy. Just Google how to, just Google this one, TensorFlow. And with download. download. Then you can find the first link in here. Click this one. This is the download page of whole uh, document to say how to download it. So just make sure you are on the Python and you have the pip install. So if you don't have the pip install, that um, you can actually I think you can download the pip just by using. Uh, let me just. If you don't have pip, if you on the. Uh, to a Linux system that you can use just copy this line copy this line and go to your terminal and paste this line that that is how simple to install the pip if you if you on the uh, Mac OS system you can either install by this way or by this way to install your pip then uh, we're going to use the pip to install my, our uh, TensorFlow. So then select the correct binary to install. Just make sure uh, what is your Python uh, version. Like for example, my Python is Python uh, 3.5. So I will use this one. And I, I'm on the uh, Mac OS X and, and uh, this one, Mac OS is only supported CPU. So I'm using the CPU only version. Uh, Python 3.4, 3.5, just copy this line. Copy this line to my, uh, to my terminal and just paste this one and hit entry. That's already uh, linked to this website. And then it just makes sure you copy one of these. If you are on the uh, Python 2, you copy this line. If you are on Python 3, you copy this line and copy that paste to your terminal and uh, to get a passport then because I'm already already uh, installed the TensorFlow in my machine so I think it will be downloaded and then it, it will say to me it, you already installed it so you don't have to install it again but for you you have to download it and install uh, th this process is automatically help you to install that so uh, to, to sum up you must have the uh, pip the right version of your pip and make sure what which version of your uh, Python and which systems you have and one more thing I need to mention is to uh, oh, he, It's uninstalling my tensorflow and reinstall again So uninstall and restore and back to that uh, I, I will mention that the difference between your if you have one of the new video GPU okay to download that GPU uh, supported TensorFlow system, TensorFlow version, because using GPU, NVIDIA GPU, the TensorFlow will detect your GPU and use your GPU instead of use your CPU because uh, by using the TensorFlow in your GPU is much faster than using CPU only. So just make sure I will find that if you have, uh, yeah, over here, the GPU version Linux only. Uh, works better with CUDA. This um, is a, a Python module, and um, this CUDA that only exists in the new Vida GPU. So you you can only use new Vida GPU. If you have, uh, it's okay for me because I'm working on Mac system. I don't have the uh, new Vida system, new Vida GPU, but the CPU version is quite work well. So I don't have to install the new Vida one. So I just choose the CPU version only. So back to that. I think it's successfully installed the tool sets and the TensorFlow already. I just get to my, I just get to my Python 3.5.1 cell and just type import tensorflow to make sure it's work. Yeah, it's definitely work. So that 
to, uh, by, by doing this, you can make sure either the TensorFlow is successfully installed into your system or you can, uh, start, you can start to use TensorFlow right this moment. So this is all for today's tutorial. So next time I will show you an example to describe how the neural network or how the machine learning doing the job. So they are actually just fitting a line or predicting a line. So I, I will show you a visualized result to further explain this idea. So if you have any issue when you install the TensorFlow, you can just leave your comment as below. So I, will, uh, I will take a look or solve your problem. If you like my videos, you can uh, subscribe my video because I have lots of uh, updating on TensorFlow or other machine learning problems. So you can just take a look. So see you next time.